We are supporting the work of the Minister for Education, the CS Education. He was with us in Nyali today. He witnessed the opening of our container. And because it's a multi-agency effort, we all want to see that the exam retains its integrity uh, that was set when we started this multi-agency uh, activity. And so far, I think uh, I've, I've looked at the reports. All our sub-counties have been able to start this exam. The, the exam has gone to the examination centers, and I think they will be starting uh, shortly. Uh, so far, we have no hitches, including uh, in our very difficult areas like uh, you know, Tana River, Lam, Taita Taveta. I think we are set for today. Uh, examination centers are safe. Like we are saying, we have this is a multi-agency effort. Uh, in places where we have, for example, Lam, where we have KDF, especially Lam East, uh, KDF is giving us support, is supporting our police officers and ourselves. And to, to deliver the exams and to ensure that the exams is actually uh, administered and is returned to the containers. So far we've had no incident relating to you know, exam safety or candidate safety and things like that. So I think we will be able to assess as the day goes by but we are confident that with the, uh, with the plans that are in place uh, the exam will be administered to the very end without any hitch. We have 52,015 candidates, out of which uh, girls are 25,864, boys are 26,151. It's a good thing. It's a good thing. I think, like the county commissioner you heard him mention there, the, the fight uh, for the protection of the girl child is bearing fruit. And we are seeing a lot of them sitting the exams healthy. You have not seen any that's expectant here or things like that. Uh, which goes to show that um, with effort, we can be able to assure both boys and girls of a future. They can go through school and they're able to finish.